now we're going to trace the top brace so we can cut it out. Now there's the top brace. Now we'll put the top brace in. That. Now we're ready to cut it out on the bandsaw. the other edge. We're going to lay this one on the other one and trace around it so we can cut it. Now it's a good idea if you're going to trace this one on the other and put them like they're going together. Now that's ready to cut out on the bandsaw. the other side cut out. Now we can put this together so you can see it's now starting to take some shape. Alright, two braces, two sides. The top fits right on there like that. Now all we've got left are the two legs. We'll cut those patterns out and put those patterns on and cut them out. We're going to draw the pattern on these legs and these feet, we call them legs or feet. Alright, now there's our pattern drawn on there. Now, before we cut that out, and if we take a 3 8 inch drill bit, we can drill a hole right there and right there, and then we won't have to cut that and it'll still be perfectly round. There's the foot cut out. We have the lines laid out for our other foot. We're going to drill the two holes and then cut it out on the bandsaw. There's the other leg. Now we're going to put them on and your arcadian stool is all built. There you have an arcadian stool. Now we have to take it all apart and we have to smooth all these edges up and sand them. And you can use a lot of different things to sand. You can use little drum sanders to sand here, here. You can use files, sandpaper. This here will sand with a belt sander. These will be with a belt sander. We'll sand them with a three sander on drill press. <laughs> See this side's nice and smooth and even. This second side the same way. After you get your sides done, we will do the braces. side.
sides and the top. We can sand our surfaces on these sides. And we're going to do that with a belt sander. We have these two braces. We can sand them also. Some people try to sand in these joints. You don't want to ever sand in those. We'll sand the top on both sides. Then we'll sand the subtop. Okay, now our top is sanded. Now we'll sand the subtop. Now we're going to put decorative edges on the top, and on the legs, the braces, and the sides, and a little bit on the sub. Put round over edges on these legs and the sides, and then we'll glue those two together. sides of this. So we'll sand these now. We have to finish our top and our set top. There, there's the top, Brad. Now the sub top only gets routed on one side uh, and one edge. So this one's going to be routed right here and this one's going to be routed right there. And it doesn't go clear to the end, it goes within three eighths of the end. So you need to mark that. Now that we have everything shaped and sanded, we just set it together. That's kind of how, how it's going to look. 